I am the UNC Master Bell Ringer. The role has tended to be in my fraternity, although that is not a set in stone kind of thing. Um, the role is appointed by the director of bands, Jeffrey Fuchs, um, and for the past five or six years it's been someone in my lineage in that fraternity. At the end of the year, after that person has finished their, their job in the role, um, they recommend the next person to Mr. Fuchs. So in here, we have all the controls for the bells up top. Um, these machines up top control the bells like the automation system itself. And then down here I have a keyboard that I can plug in. And if I want to manually control the bells, I can do it like that. We have 14 bells, each of them are labeled within these red post-its. Let's play Victory, my favorite. And then it just goes. So pretty simple. So this is the console I used to practice on. It has the 12 levers, um, C through E, B flat, F sharp. Um, and there's actually springs on each of the levers that mimics the tension of pulling the rope. We have the permanent roll that starts over here in 31 um, when the tower is built. It goes over to 53 when they stop recording. There's a project underway currently with several of us to finish the list and get everyone um, on it. We do have a donor who's offered to finish the list off and get everyone on there. We actually are one of, I think, only, I want to say 15 universities in the nation, somewhere around that many, that actually have real bells in their bell tower and still use them. I know State just has a recording. It's not, not nearly as cool. But I think the limitations here make us more authentic.